while Prideaux noted that the Old Hebrew alphabet was the same as the Samaritan alphabet, he also pointed out that it is identical to the Phoenician alphabet. When we compare the letters of these three alphabets, we can see this similarity. This is the letter Bet in the Old Hebrew, the Samaritan, and the Phoenician. Note the close similarity of each. Also note the similarities of the letter He in each of these alphabets. The 1831 edition of the Encyclopedia Americana also makes this connection between the Phoenician, Samaritan, and Hebrew alphabets. The Hebrew's written characters were the same as the Phoenician, to which the letters of the Samaritan manuscripts approached the nearest. The Phoenicians lived north of the land of Israel, centered around the biblical cities of Sidon and Tyr, in modern-day Lebanon between the 6th and 3rd century BCE. The Phoenicians shared the same alphabet with the Hebrews and the Samaritans. It was also evident that the Phoenicians and Hebrews spoke the same language as the Foreign Quarterly Review wrote in its 1838 publication. The learned world had almost universally allowed that the Phoenician language was, with few exceptions, identical with the Hebrew. While the origins of the old Hebrew alphabet was widely accepted, this theory was based on a limited amount of evidence, as the Foreign Quarterly Review points out. What is left of Phoenician consists of a few inscriptions and coins. However, in the latter half of the 19th century, and into the 21st century, many new discoveries were made that would cement this theory in place.